Good morning, folks. Today we're going to get the satellite look at those three storms in the Pacific. We'll see two excellent papers, one on solar forcing and the other on hypomagnetic stress on the body. We're also going over space weather in the last 24 hours on our star. More minor flares, no major CMEs released towards the Earth. There's still that weak CME expected to arrive at Earth tonight or tomorrow. Should be a minor event. There are two things I'm keeping an eye on in the days ahead besides that small CME. Switching to pink, 211 angstroms. We see a small coronal hole near center disk. I am wondering if it's too small to impact the solar wind. We'll find out early this coming week. And of course, we're watching the everlasting train of sunspots for more flaring and eruptive activity. Looks to be more active regions coming over the limb as well. Up next, we're at the Goes West, looking down on those three storm systems in the Pacific. First one already impacting Hawaii. Next one is churning strongly, heading that way as well. Eyes on them. First up in the articles today, we find about the 20th study just this year on solar forcing of floods and extreme precipitation. Significant increases in flooding occur during sunspot minima, and the relationship is quite robust, likely due to the cloud amplification mechanism of cosmic rays, which peak when sunspots are low. We have another paper on hypomagnetic conditions as well. Hypomagnetism is the lack of magnetic field, so these studies apply to things like space travel, but also for the Earth as it loses its magnetic field protection during the ongoing magnetic pole shift. Oxidative stress linked to mitochondrial dysfunction impacting nearly every cell in the body, one of the main reasons to be as healthy as possible during this geomagnetic excursion. Folks, as many of you know, Observer Ranch is complete. The RV Campground and Education Center is about to open. We have an open house the last two days of this month. You can get your tickets at the link below. We'd love to see you out there. And if you can't make the grand opening, General Reservation System goes online tomorrow. Link below to tickets. More information at ObserverRanch.com. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.